welcome everybody to the 100th video of Beer Dad Reviews, me, Dave the Beer Dad. Now the video you're, you're about to watch um, was filmed last night at the Peerless Brewery in Birkenhead for their Thirsty Friday event. It's open tap room day, we're from half four till half ten, when they open the tap room up and you can go in and you can enjoy Peerless beers um, for £2.50 a pint. I actually say in the video it's £2, it's not, it's £2.50 a pint, that was my mistake. Um, I was going to, the idea was I was going to go in because they have eight different drinks on. I was going to have a review, eight different beers, put them into a monster video and upload it. But what actually happened was I ended up doing a review with the owner, um, Steve Briscoe. And I think it's, a, it's an opportunity um, to do a video with an owner of a brewery, then you've got to take it. So that's what I did. That's not what I was going to do. But it's a really short video, but it's really informative. Steve's a great guy. The guys at Peerless are fantastic and they're really welcoming. And a little bit of a tour around the uh, the brewery as well, um, and the ales were the ales were brilliant. But this is the El Dorado, their Jude uh, Summer Ale review. Okay, so enjoy. Okay, guys, welcome to another Beer Dad reviews with me, Dave the Beer Dad. Um, I'm here at the Peerless uh, Brewery in Bacon Head on the Whittle, um, and I'm here with Steve, the owner and the uh, of, of the Peerless Brewery. And we're going to just go go through a couple of things with the uh, the brewery. It's the Thirsty Friday Tap Day. So it's an open day, um, turn up, get your pints, two pound a go. So Steve, what we're going to do, first of all, is just go through your uh, through the beers and stuff. So we're looking at, today we're looking at El Dorado. Cheers. Looks Cheers. Good. All right. There's the clip. You can see that. So El Dorado is the name. It's 4.8%. Um, the hop is El Dorado. A little bit of Centennial, but mainly El Dorado. Uh, lovely golden ale, lovely fruity colour. So there's the clip, you'll see it, it's out as a special for this month. Should we have a taste? Yes, yeah, have a taste. Well, let's have a look, tell you what. Let's have a look, let's have a look, let's put, put the light and see what it's like. Yeah. But that, that, that's crystal clear, and it's got a reasonable head, just, just shy of a half a finger. Okay, um, that's, that's pulled with a loose sparkler, so we don't want too much head. Okay, the bubbles inside are um, really tightly compact, uh, it's a white head. So what we get on the nose, give it a go. What do you get? I'm getting, I'm getting citrus, massive citrus. Yeah. Oranges. I'm getting sort of soft fruits as well. Yeah. So I think it's a bit of citrus, a bit of orange, a bit of orange, a bit of grapefruit. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. And a bit of mango. You get that sort of soft stone, stone fruit. Yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. that kind yeah. of. Yeah. I think okay. right there. Can you give it a go. Yeah. Let's give it a go. Okay. Let's stop sniffing and start drinking. Indeed. Hmm. The carbonation is really good. It's dead, the body is dead light. The carbonation is, is, is there's very little carbonation there, which is really good. So it's not going to um, give anybody any kind of indigestion. Or, no, well, I, to be mean? honest, you shouldn't get them too highly carbonated. No, it's, it's all right. But you need, you need a little, just a little spritz to, to mm. get it going. You can taste the citrus on it straight away. Yeah. Um, this is all about the back end. You know, so it's not what I would call a multi beer. Mm -hmm. It's very on the on the hop to malt continuum. It's very much on the hop side. Yeah, yeah. Of things, yeah. it's got medium bitterness, but all the the big kicks at the end. Yeah, there's a little so bit of dryness. So it goes down, well. got a little bit of dryness. Yeah, and that's the El Dorado kicking it. Right. So that's what you that's what you're getting in the end. So. Um, oh, one of the taste. This is fun. This it, is fantastic. It, it makes you want more, doesn't it? I, could, I think I could do four or five of these quite happily and I'm not thinking anything of it. This is, a, this is one of these beers um, where I could sit in the garden and just relax and get it down me quite easily. I, I could be doing that myself later on. <laughs> good man. <laughs> it's on a Friday. Oh, so, um, yeah, it's good. But well, there we go. Is this going to be available to the general public? It's out now. This is the first week it's gone out. Okay. So this is the first pint of the first barrel. Okay. That you're drinking. Excellent. Um, I mean, you're here on Thursday, Friday. Yeah. We, what we tend to do is make sure we keep one for ourselves. Um, the best test is to drink it. If you can't drink it, don't drink it yourself. Still you're good. not. You're not going to. You're yeah. not going to sell it. Yeah, I agree. So uh, we go through it. We're fairly rigorous. Put it on the bar, and we get pretty. You know what the people, the good people of Birkenhead are like. Uh, they're not shy of. Uh, no, they're not shy of uh, Of giving out the comments. So. Uh, so what's your what what's your distribution? Is it just here? No. Uh, this will go uh, mainly around the northwest. Okay. Uh, but we do have some going out wholesale. So. Right. You'll see it all over the country. But it's only being brewed for the month of July. I mean, today's the 30th of June, 29th of June. Yeah. It's out now into the industry, and it'll be going out over the next month. 
So uh, we brew this one every couple of years. We're getting a back catalogue now, and this is one of the mainstays that will come out every couple of years. Right. Uh, and we like this particular hop, so it's El Dorado. Is, um, or El Dorado. El Dorado. As somebody said recently. That's a, but it's definitely El Dorado. It's a beautiful, beautiful drop. It really is. If you can see, if you can find this in any craft beer shops where you, in your area, then pick it up because it is a beautiful, beautiful drink. I'm not just saying it because the man sat next to me. Dead honest with a bit more reviews. This is Bob on, and it's a great little drink. Summer ale, beautiful. It's good, isn't it? Oh. Excellent. Thanks for that, Dave. No problem. Appreciate it. Cheers. Hail ale, everybody. Hail ale. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that. Say short and sweet. Uh, thank you all very much for my my subscribers uh, for getting me through this hundred videos. Uh, and here's the next hundred. Um, I've got tons of stuff in the fridge waiting to be done. So. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Hail the ale, everybody. Always hail the ale.